Hello. Well, today we're doing the review on the EP Solar uh, 40 amp uh, charge controller. And um, all right, um, don't forget to hit the like button, hit the subscribe, and uh, let's go ahead and get started. All right, guys, um, we do have the EP Ever MPPT Solar Charge Controller. It says advanced MPPT technology. High tracking efficiency, no less than 99.5% tracer series. Um, these are one of the, uh, this is actually a Chinese company. Um, this is made in China, but it's one of those uh, little better companies, um, EP Solar or EP Ever. Um, yeah, so the side, you got the, the um, SQU and you know some other numbers in there made in China this is Nemo Info pretty simple model tracer 4210A voltage 12 and 24 um, current 40 amp max PV voltage 100 uh, volts max PV input power 520 watts at 12 um, volts in a 12 volt uh, battery bank or you can do 1040 watts on a 12 24 volts battery bank so that's what that those numbers mean nothing on the bottom here's the front Co Park uh, Hang Road District, Beijing, China. Yeah. So apparently this is a high, a high quality uh, MPPT charge controller. You got the certificate of QC Pass quality control. Um, and then we have some instruction manual some basic uh, instructions all right and then we've got the charge controller here basically says EP Ever Tracer and this looks like the the LCD screen um, to button function MPPT solar charge controller CROHS looks like this uh, we got the we got the solar we got the solar in which is positive solar negative then we got the battery, battery positive battery negative and then this is the load it's the load positive and the load negative the load means if you want to connect like a live light bulb or or something that's going to be around this um, unit you know like a light bulb or a fan or or something that's going to be around this you can connect it here um i wouldn't uh, connect a, a real heavy load there because this this is probably not you know heavy duty stuff um, that's why you have an inverter for that so you can connect the heavier loads but yeah this is the battery and this is the the solar panel basically and here's the connections on the bottom I don't know if you guys can see it there you go it's green um, here's the connection I believe this is the temperature sensor and this is the it's like a uh, what is Ethernet uh, wire or uh, cable? Um, you can connect the like a separate um, a controller. But you have to buy that separate, by the way. And this is the back. It's all metal. It's uh, it, it looks pretty well built. Okay, that's the top. It says made model um, tracer for 
4210A. It says voltage 12 and 24, current 40 amp. Okay, it's the same thing as the what it says in the box. And it says QC passed. So I guess they got some sort of quality control in that company. I will be connecting um, one or two, I haven't decided yet, one or two um, 255 watt uh, solar panels um, to this device. Um, I did get this device because I, I uh, my Harbor Freight um, 100 watt uh, solar system is not enough for the batteries I got because I just got some batteries. Um, I got 10 uh, I got a total of 10 um, uh, Trojan T105s so that's a lot of batteries for 100 watts so I needed to get something bigger um, for my solar panels and for as a charge controller so I got this device and we'll see how this works